This video is about common geotechnical terms. The first term is scarify and recompact. Scarifying is used to compact the top one foot of a surface. It is performed by ripping the surface with a dozer or grater, adding water, and then rolling. Remove and recompact. This is performed by removing material from an area, putting the material back in in lifts, adding water, and then rolling it to density. Undocumented fill is any material that has been brought in from another source that wasn't compacted or documented as being compacted. So if you look at the background, you can see a bunch of end dump piles there. They haven't been compacted, so we can't put a building on them because it will compress or settle over time. Uncompacted fill must be removed and recompacted or replaced with imported fills underneath a building before the building can be constructed. Uncompacted fills under a parking lot can be removed and recompacted, just scarified and recompacted, or a combination of these methods in order to reduce costs. Pinholes. Um, if you look at the background of this picture, you see little holes throughout the soil. It's any soil that, can, that has pinholes, has small skinny holes throughout the soil and it reacts, um, the material reacts similar to undocumented fill and it compresses when a load's placed on it. So you handle it the same way that we handle undocumented fills by removal and recompaction, scarifying and recompacting or replacing it with import. Structural fill. Structural fill is any soil approved by the geotechnical engineer that's been compacted to the required density and moisture content. This often gets confused with engineered fill. And we'll do a definition of engineered fill, but engineered fill and structural fill are not the same thing. Structural fill can be any soil that the geotechnical engineer approves to be used in a certain area. Now that we've talked about structural fill, let's talk about engineered fill. Engineered fill has been engineered, so it's been sized and crushed and coming from a pit according to the engineer's uh, requirements. It's often referred to as three inch minus or e-fill or sometimes even borrow. Engineered fill is granular material that has low fines content or low silts and clays. Usually it's only used under footings, as sub base under parking lots, or as imported utility trench backfill out in the road.